So here's one fully loaded and finished, so you see what it looks like there? One thing is, when you choose your brand, you can also change out the tap. All right, I have a little a, magnet system with like a bud, a shock tap, you snap it on there. <laughs> Did you really? That's you awesome. Got your tapper. But here's how it works when you're going to change yeah, it. Yeah, Amelia just sent you a picture. First of all, charge your battery, Stand by make sure second. it's fully charged. So I've got Chill your beer, up. make sure it's fully, fully chilled. Step number two is load in, you know in draft systems, line cleaning is such a pain. This is your line right here. Oh, we just did. Load it in. Right in here. Put that. Where's it go? Right in here. Okay. This, Very the, important. This Very is important the spout. Mm -hmm. Drop it in there. Very important stuff. Yes. Snap it in. Number three, you load in your bottle and you just rotate it and it clicks right in place. Line Get those arrows area. lined up and you've got this to visually. Now, did you be honest with you? Did you build one of these things in your garage? We've been <laughs> working on prototypes for years. All right? And you heard that little. Yeah. Charging up, and you heard a little crackle in the bottle. Uh -huh. What's going on is the battery is pressurizing with yeah. a pump. It's actually pumping air in between two layers of this bottle. So the beer never touches the air. It goes from the tank in the brewery into this little mini tank, and the first time it's ever exposed is in your glass. So if you wanted a shock top, two tricks. Keep it close and a pretty heavy angle first. Get some light going here, Trigo. All right. There you go. Just like right close in here. And then the, that's, that's number one. Number two is just pull it swiftly all the way to the end. If you hang out in the middle, you'll get more foam. But if you pour it all the way down, look at that. Kicks up a beautiful collar of foam. And you can hear that little hum recharging itself. Look, but the foam is tight bubbles, beautiful lacing, and this head will stand around and say hi all morning long. <laughs> you do it even on the first pour. And what is it? If you've ever tried on in in uh, in bars, you often get a couple of pitchers of foam. So the first glass is a little bit a little bit foamy. Yeah. But as soon as you get past this first one, and this will settle settle down nicely, as soon as you get past that first glass, you got complete control. Dude, this is amazing. Beautiful. That beautiful glass of bud there. And now your first glass is all settled in. I actually prefer more foam, so this yeah. one's for me. That one's yours. Cheers.